Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Continuing our dental education series, Donsha Dental Care brings to you a new video on teeth whitening. We have previously covered dental crown and bridge in part 1, dental implant in part 2, consequences of not replacing missing teeth in part 3 and dental veneers in part 4. Check out the links in the description box below. Let's now begin the procedure of teeth whitening. First, an impression is made using an impression tray and suitable material. This impression tray is used to make a cast or model of your teeth so that we can send it to the lab where they customize your tray. Once the tray is ready and delivered to you, apply small drops of whitening material in the center of each tooth space in the tray so that when you wear it, the whitening material is spread evenly on your teeth. Depending on the material used, the duration of how long you should put the tray on will be mentioned to you. This is one of the ways of teeth whitening. While in our clinic, the whitening gel is directly applied on the tooth surface without the help of a tray. Let us show you the before afters of a few cases done in our clinic. Now, there are certain rules that you need to follow after whitening. For 48 hours after whitening, you have to maintain a white diet where you have to avoid colored food items like food with turmeric, red chili powder, coke or other aerated drinks, wine, rum etc. You also have to avoid smoking. Strictly adhere to white diet as otherwise you will not achieve your desired brightness. Let's talk about some frequently asked questions about whitening. Is it painful? Absolutely not. The procedure is completely painless. Does it lead to sensitivity? It might lead to some sensitivity for which desensitizing toothpastes are readily available in the market. How long does it stay? In general, it lasts for two years after which slowly you get back the original color of your teeth and even then it depends on your food habits. One very important thing to keep in mind is, before whitening, you have to get a scaling done if you have calculus deposits or external stains in your teeth. In our next video, we will be coming up with an effective way of scaling using AquaCare. Like, share and subscribe our channel for more dental related videos and press the bell icon so that you do not miss the video on AquaCare.